Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Hello, my people. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Governor Wiki in trouble. Can you believe that? Thank you very much for always supporting us, for always coming out here, for always being there. I want to say a big thank you. We sincerely, truly, and really appreciate you. Well, today's one is quite an interesting one. It's concerning the governor of River State, Wiki. Let's get to the news and get all the details. Wiki dragged to ECOWAS court over exclusive lawlessness. Can you believe that? Remember all that happened during the lockdown in River State, all the issues that happened? Well, Governor Wiki has been dragged to the ECOWAS court over exclusive lawlessness during the lockdown. Wiki has been sued to ECOWAS court over issues and all that happened during the lockdown in River State. Governor Wiki has been dragged to the ECOWAS Court of Justice in Abuja over the brutal crackdown, repression and, gra and gravious violation and abuse of human rights of the people of River State. Joined at the defendant is the govern government of President Muhammadu Buhari, Hey, now Buhari Dragon go call to now then join. Say we can behave anyhow. Hmm. Hey, the liturgy is social economic rights and accountability projects. In the suit filed last Friday, accuses Wiki of using COVID-19 as a pretext to step up repression and systematic abuse against the people of Rivers State, including by carrying out massive aberration, detention, mistreatment, forced eviction, imposition, proagulation, control on daily life of the people of River State. Governor Wiki is using exclusive order 1 and 6 2020 as instrumented to violate and abuse the right of liberty and freedom from the people, arrest and detention to a fair tribunal and to proper containing of the matter. Contrary to Nigeria's international human rights obligations, including under the African Chart on Human Rights, on Human and People Rights, and the International Covenant on Civil and Public Rights, human rights violators have said this suit is primarily against Governor Wiki and the River State Government for failing to respect, protect, and ensure constitutional and international guarantee of human rights of the people of his state. The governor has used Executive Order 1 and 6 to run rough shoulders over the people's rights in Nigeria. These are Nigerian citizens. Unfortunately, the federal government, being, being the signatory to ECOWAS, and protocol cannot escape its responsibility to ensure human rights and guarantee under human rights statutes to which Nigeria is a state parity and one of the leaders are fully and effectively realizing throughout Nigerian government, including the River State government. So in the federal government, alongside Governor Wiki, is entirety constitution, constituted with Article 27 of the Vena Convention on the Law of Treatment, which provides that a state may not invoke or provision of any international law as justification for its failure to perform a treaty. Human rights spoke man is asking the courts for an order of injunction to restrain and stop Governor Wiki from further using, applying and enforcing Executive Order 1 and 6 or any other executive order to harass, arrest, detain, demolish property of the people of River State. They also said he's also seeking an order directly directing Governor Wiki and other defendants to pay adequate monetary compensation to the victims of human rights violation and abuse and to provide other forms of repatriation 
which may take the form of restitution, satisfaction, or guarantee of non-repeat of such in any way or form. Honorable Court also is also fit to make sure and to enforce that this come to pass. The suit filed on human rights behalf of his, soli of his solidarity Kola Atiku Okbeyemi read in part contained that several persons were abruptly abused, arrested, detained, and various police station and isolation center of River State without any regard for due law process. Governor Wike and his agent used applied and enforced executive order one and six to suppress and oppress the human rights of the people, their business operative, including harassment, brutality, arrest, detaining and torturing anyone found excluding you anyone trying to enforce their basic human rights. All these grievances and enforce measures provided all were used as an excuse of the COVID-19 in the states to suppress the people of River State. The wanting destruction of people's property, harassment, har arrest, detention of people, destruction of hotels, and grossly violation of the human rights is against Nigerian constitution of the 1999 as amended and the country international human rights obligation. The executive order include exclusive order six by Governor Wiki are invalid, illegal, and constitutionally having not been complied with with regardments of due process of law. The order of Governor Wiki to demolish any hotel or guest house found operative in River State is alter violent and penalty stipends in excluding and giving orders for people to carry out demolition. Demolition of hotel and guest houses is illegal and unconstitutional, and as it run foul into the penalty stipulated in the Quarantine Act, which provide only a fine of 200 naira or imprisonment for the term of six months or both. The demolition is a brutality violation of Article 14 of the African Charter of Human Rights and People's Rights. Governor Wiki demolish workers and security agents without due process of law, demolish Prado Hotel, Aladon in Elume, and Etako Hotel in Onu on Saturday, May the 9th, 2020, fragling bridging the rights of the owner, employers, and occupants of the hotel. The demolition was supervised by the governor himself, Wiki, and the company of security agencies of the federal government of Nigeria. Human rights, human rights representative contained that Governor Wiki, with all these allegations levied against him, suppressed and used the federal government uh, re resources of security agencies to carry out the demolition without giving adequate notice, compensation, alternative hotel, or affecting the affected victim being relocated, accommodated, and looked after. Many people have now been deprived of their means of livelihood, employment, shelter, exposed to other serious human rights violations and abuse. All these and many more are the allegations he gave no Governor Wiki and he said to meet up with all the obligations to pay or go to prison. Well, my people, when I don't hear him, they say Wiki don't enter trouble for what he do. Say, now Buhari administration carry Wiki to court. Say, Wiki violates human rights. Well, Wiki is on the only governor in the in, that is standing up to the federal government and guess what buhari's government did not um talk to police that killed people indiscriminate shooting brutality of humans we never hear of anybody going to court to only wiki and do you know why because he said a majority should not enter his state it's not because of demolition my people let me tell you there's no demolition there is because the north we are being denied 
uh, peoples uh, the north those that came to sell things that came to came and they were trying to sneak into the states he denied them he did not allow them in he auctioned their trucks he made sure that they did not see they did not come into the state to misbehave that's why the buhari administration has taken him to ECOWAS court anyway we'll be keeping you informed as the news comes and keeps rolling in this is what is going on now i would like you to stay tuned don't forget to thumbs up for us like and share click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news god bless you and bye for now